What is up guys, Pie Muffin here, and we are back with our Star Ocean Anamnesis video. So if you watched my previous video, which actually both these videos should be coming out together, uh, my previous video is basically just a breakdown of the new bridal units as well as the new awakening stuff, but let's go into here and just kind of show it off real quick. So you go over to awakenings, and basically what's going to happen, as they add more characters, they'll light up here. So as you can see, Fidel right there. Um, obviously, I have all four units that you are able to awaken. Oh, I thought I had Evelise Awaken. I guess I don't. So, uh, basically, what you, you don't even have to have them six-star to start this. So, they basically have um, these uh, orb things, basically, and you need this currency in order to awaken. So, Steadfast Courage is, you know, a talent that they'll be able to have. You'll have different stuff for uh, ability upgrades and stuff like that. So, this will be very good for kind of, like... A little bit outdated units to kind of try and make them more relevant again so that is very cool um but yeah so we're gonna hop over to the banner now and do our summons so let's go ahead and check out the banner i think i want uh i'm trying to really decide because maria has more uh attack and defense but nell has more hp and i'm always more of a kind of person for hp that's kind of cool that they have campaign character draws for these specific characters as well if you really want to pull them. But players who have been playing for a decent amount of time should already have these units for, you know, your daily pulls and stuff like that. Um, so what we're going to do first is I'm going to have try my hand at pulling uh, from these. I think this is an ace ticket. No, these are just I just have regular five star guaranteed tickets. Okay. Um, yeah, no, okay, so we're just gonna pull. I have a bunch of these like regular tickets, and the four star tickets guaranteed aren't that good, but the four to five are nice. Um, so yeah, we're gonna hop over to the banner. I'm gonna do four multis max. If I don't pull one of the bridal units in that, I'm gonna save because there will be a part two to the, the bridal stuff, I'm assuming. Um, because these things usually come in waves of two, so there should be two more bridal units coming later down, uh, the line. I'm re just based on design-wise, I, I think I'm, I'm more privy to wanting to have Nell, but, um, and that critical hit chance is really nice, but party da attack damage is also really nice, so we'll see what we walk away with. Um, let's go ahead and do our first multi. Um, obviously if I pull one of them, I'm gonna stop, you know, however many... Uh, multis I've done. Uh, maybe we can get lucky and uh, walk away with the first. Oh, well, there's two five stars there, so there's a chance. I'm not usually that lucky, though, but we'll see. Um, really, when they try to start flooding us with the. Okay, no. Alright, Emerson. Very cool. You're not a bride, though. Alright, well, <laughs> that's all we needed to do. <laughs> bride Maria. I'm not going to end it there because we've only been doing a three-minute video. I'll do two more multis, and then we'll kind of uh, end it there. Um, that's already the two that we need, but while I'm talking here. So that's very good that I was able to get Marie on the first one. Obviously, like it's always the way that I kind of say it is like I say the one unit, and I'll pull the other like almost immediately. I remember when I first started playing this... Um, I played the, started playing this day one. Hana was the first uh, healer I used because obviously there wasn't a real uh, healer in the game yet. Like in day one, there wasn't really. Uh, plus, you know, you didn't pull everybody you wanted. Um, so that's that's pretty nice. That's what's kind of nice about this game is you know any character can be six starred and kind of worked with. So. We are good with this, you know, Bride Maria, very nice. More enchanted tablets for me to uh, not really use that much. All right, so we're gonna give two more multis and see if we can walk away with Nell as well. Now, obviously, if we pull Nell on the second multi, no, we're not going to, okay. Let's just go ahead and skip that because uh, we can already tell that that's not gonna be anything. Um, but yeah, if we had pulled her on that second multi, there's obviously... If you pull both units... I mean, unless you don't want to have to farm for uh, the currency to kind of... Ooh, that's not... Okay, so we're doing the fourth multi anyway. Um, 
Plus, this is good for me because this is more uh, upgrading stuff. Because I would like to limit break 10 uh, Maria if I can. Um, so, yeah. So, what's nice about that is basically... Oh, wow. A new three star that I didn't have. That's uh, surprising. Um, you know, you get all these extra things to basically limit break. But I don't chase dupes for characters because I don't mind waiting or grinding up the uh, awakening currency. All right. That was two dead multis in a row. Let's see if we can get lucky with this last one. And if we pull nothing with this, we're stopping here. You know, I'm good. Come on, let's see. A. All right, all right, all right. Can we see more than one? Up, oh, I see two. Okay. So maybe we'll get lucky here. Maybe it won't be a dupe of Maria, but you never know. Let's see what kind of goodies we're going to walk away with here. Ooh, what do I have? I don't remember if I pulled Mavelle. I don't think I did. See, that's why I always say don't chase the campaign characters. Um, unless you're someone who's playing very casually, there's really no reason to chase them because stuff like this will happen where you'll pull the character um, without having to spend extra, basically. Alright, who's our second five star in this poll? I think it should be the next character. Ah, like oh, we got Maria again. All right, no problem, though, because we walked away with... Uh, all right, that's one less limit break I have to do. Okay, yeah, I didn't have Mavel, so there you go. I walked away with two brand new units that I didn't have. Um, so that's good. I'm definitely going to work on uh, getting Maria. Maria is actually... Gameplay-wise, Maria is actually probably the better unit, so I really can't complain there. Um, definitely an attack heavy team she's gonna be very useful for but uh, let me know how your guys polls went down below I always see some of you get lucky and some of you don't um, which is unfortunate for those who don't um, but hopefully some of this luck I had in this video other than those two middle multis can uh, rub off on you guys anyways guys let me know what you guys think down below don't forget to subscribe for more if you need a channel I'll see you all next time have a wonderful day everyone